So there are seven layers of relationship. The first relationship is mom's belly. You know, we all have been in this first relationship. So pure dependency, completely, it's literally survival. You know, we develop and we, mom is the goddess, dad is God. When we are born, we just exit the relationship that we just had. And then we're just coming into a, into the second layer of relating what's the family home. There might be dad around, there might be auntie around, there might be siblings around or grandparents around. So this kind of state where people having this family dynamics going on. So and uh, where we grow up in you know and uh, so this is what family relationship literally is about having these connections that we have with people they are very close to us family and then we're just growing up out of that in puberty and then we're just going out and seeing that there are other relating so who can do something with whom so this so-called shopping zone so poly open poly idiotic um, open fucking around kind of no agreements just like who is doing what with whom and this is nobody else's business the shopping zone is where most people are getting stuck in their relationship and then most people when they're stuck there they actually want to evolve but what they're doing then they're going back into the second one as a family dynamic but creating the fourth one what is the fusion or codependency you're mine, I'm yours, we are just like closed and one is open, one is closed or they're just like open and then something in between is a relationship and nobody really knows what it is and how it functions and and then you have a lot of ideologies and conditionings, romantic dreams, happy ever after and you know whatever ideas exist there and then kind of people waking up from that and this is where the teaching of uh, number five or the adulthood comes in. So this is the base. You know, I have my base, you have your base. I have my rights, you have your rights. I have my responsibilities, you have yours. You know, what's happening in my base, who I'm talking with and who I relate to, how it's just my cup of tea and it's your cup of tea. And from there we have, you know, full ownership about our feelings, our body, our thoughts, beliefs, you know, desires limits and all that that we're two sovereign beings yeah and that everybody who is relating are two sovereign beings and this is where we can actually really engage in having a life that is functional or livable and from there we're just like dropping into the next layer this is the sixth and the seventh layer so the sixth layer is when this sovereignty and autonomy is is given then higher principles can come through the four pillars the agreements yeah. And then how do we want to actually engage so that we can vibrate in this frequency of where we are, who we are, what we want to share, where we want to go and um, what's our vision, what's our purpose in life and what's the value. And then we can bring this higher principles the higher values through in this relating. So the relating becomes the higher value. This is a vibration that I can feel that is resonating. You know, it's so this vibration, this structure that is just alive that people see, well, I want to have what they have because it's, it's real, it's livable, it's authentic. So then we create a project and this project is based on this higher principles. Out of that project, we evolve and transform into the seventh step of relating where we create something that is meaningful, not only to ourselves, but it's meaningful to other people because they can relate to that. It's a frequency of resonance that is invitive because there's a, it's resonating with people. They just want to have that. They come and say, this is, this is what you have. This is what I want. And they feeling drawn into that. They just want to know, how do you do that? How can we live that this is functional, that this is working? And that's pure on negotiation to create something that is higher than that, what we know. People, yeah, there are these four layers, you know, and it comes with the somatic embodiment. It comes with our rights, with our action towards our own benefit it comes with asking for permission and asking somebody else to do something while we're respecting somebody else's limit till we fully embodied integrity generosity gratitude and can surrender into something that is the unknown and then coming from a place of real love and care for others so where we're becoming this powerful visionary leader this um loving caring activist of we carrying a frequency 
that can make a change and a difference. So if that is resonating with you, then I'm so looking forward to welcome you here into this higher valuable principles. And from there, we radiate out and inviting people into that, what we have in our cellular vibration. 